Hello and welcome to my little video about uh, hyperlapse uh, from Instagram. Some people ask me to do a video in English and so I would like to show you uh, how you reach the hidden menu. You need four fingers and tap four times uh, to the black screen like this. One, two, three, four. Et voila. Now you see the hyperlapse lapse menu and the first thing is you can change the resolution from 720p to 1080p and you can change also the frame rate from I think 24 frames is the default to 30 frames per second. This is the speed uh, the video will play after the recording. Um, the background save and library um, will save the unstabilized hyperlapse uh, file to the camera roll uh, as a video file and you also have the previous hyperlapses in uh, library uh, so you can choose uh, these recordings. The calibration mode um, I'm not sure what this exactly does uh, there's no video recording but uh, does some calibration thing I'm not sure about this. The most important thing here uh, in the menu is resolution is the frame rate and the hyperlapse extreme. All the other uh, settings here, um, I didn't try any of this because I'm not sure what it does. So uh, I would recommend to uh, keep away from the settings. I'm not sure what it does, but you can feel free to try and maybe you can uh, discuss it under this video. Um, but yeah, at your own risk. So when you choose Hyperlapse Extreme, you can, you can choose the playback speed from 1 times to 40 times, not to uh, 12 times as it is in the default. When you download the app, it's 40 times the speed. So you have more flexibility of the video. Okay, so you can try it at your own. Uh, some people reported that it's not working on uh, iPad uh, Retina Mini, but uh, I can't test it. So maybe if there's anyone who has an um, iPad Mini Retina and it works, maybe he can do a video. He can do a video and post it under this. Okay, thank you very much. Um, yeah, if there's any questions, let me know. And yeah, have a great weekend. Okay, bye.